Good morning everyone, my name is Akesh Kopta and I'm with Lightspeed Solutions. In this series of uh, doing the video presentation, I would like to discuss how easy it is to initialize a field value in EarnSpeed with a calculated value. To begin with, let's look at a use case. Here's an example of an account where we basically have been playing with this uh, same example in all the other videos. As we are adding up uh, a record for an account, we have defaulted the value to, a, to created by as well as a last contact date. The use case here is that we would like the next contact date to be at least say 30 days from today's date but allow the user to be able to modify it in case he or she wishes to do so. If we go back to RNSP Designer on our ad page we definitely have our uh, last contact date uh, and created by and as you saw we were able to calculate the field value so we have covered partially this concept but what I'm trying to share with you is that sometimes you may want to apply a default value which is also a calculated value when the ad page is shown but still have the user the ability to modify it. So in this particular case if we were to assign a straightforward value we could have easily said uh, functions, date and time and today's date. But what we would like to do is we would like to basically add X number of days to the uh, basically um, the today's date. So what we, we can do here is we of course we already know that there's a function and this function I'm not sure if it's available here but if you are available if you are uh, aware of the dot net we have uh, date time functions and so on so I can go in and type in today's date uh, dot add days and click 30. So what basically system is doing is it's taking a date today's date and then it's calling an add days function on top of it. So the point I'm trying to make is sometimes some functions are not available in the RNSP designer function library but doesn't mean that you cannot use them. You can definitely use those functions as long as they are going to be compatible with .NET at the end of the day. So in this particular case the next contact date is going to be 30 days from today and we will not adjust the property so this way it is going to still stay as a editable field and the user will be able to change it to whatever they wish to do so. So we basically just uh, put the field together and I'm going to basically refresh the page. Of course system will ask me to re-log in and what I can do here is I can log back in here and now if I click on an add button as you can see the system did take the today's date added 30 days to it but at the same time still has the ability to alter whatever you want to change to in case the next 30 days is not feasible. So the point I'm trying to make here is that you can initialize a field value with a calculated value which goes beyond the available functions in RNSP Designer. As long as you know these functions are .NET compatible functions you can easily add them. I hope you folks enjoyed the video and you saw the flexibility that RNSpeed brings to initialize a field value with a calculated value which goes beyond the built-in functions. Keep watching for the more videos and thanks for your time.